Hello smart people, welcome back to this comments class. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to link Excel sheets. So here we have a business ledgers where we have the income for the first quarter 2024 and also we have the expenses for the first quarter 2024. So here what you are going to do is to link these two sheet we have the sales sheet we have the expenses and now we have the summary so at the summary side we have the income first quarter 2024 we have the expenses first quarter 2024 now we want to know the profit the business made so we are going to subtract the expenses from the income so with this one we are going to put the total income here from the sales sheet and the expenses too we are going to put the expenses here from the expenses sheets okay now when you come to the sales sheet you will be picking the total now when you look at the total it's on c7 so c7 and here the expenses is on the expenses total is on B7. B7. So we are just going to capture this figures here onto the summary. Okay. Now you come to the place you want to insert or you want to display the total or the results from another sheet. And now you type equal to, and now the name of the sheet. So the first one is the sales. So we have sales. Now when you put the sales, you add exclamation mark and on the cell, so it will see seven. Okay. So C7, we have 100,300. So the sales, so the total sales is 100,300. So we have it, 100,000. Okay, so here is it. And now let's go to the expenses. We have 40,435. And now it was B7. Okay, so equal to expenses. That is the sheet's name, expenses. And now exclamation mark B7. And now it will give us the total here too. That is 40,435. Okay, now we are done. We will just do some simple calculations here. So let's subtract the expenses from the income, which we are getting 62,565. Okay, so here we've been able to link two different Excel sheets to another. So this is the way you can link two sheets. In an Excel, in an Excel file, or in an Excel sheet. Okay, so let's say doing your your linking, you are done, and now there have been some addition. So here, let's say they bought another car. Let's say Ford, and the Ford, it was the the year the model year was let's say twenty eighteen, and the price was maybe twenty one thousand. Yes. Now the total sum we are getting one hundred and twenty-four thousand. Let's go and check whether we are seeing one hundred and twenty-four thousand at the summary. Okay. So we are getting one hundred and twenty-four thousand at the summary. Let's assume the expenses. It has not changed. The expenses too remains the same. So any updates or any touches which you do in the other sheet will have effect on the sheet you've linked you've linked the two or one excel two so it's very simple the the excel the excel function or the the code will be shared in the description section so here we have the equal to sales exclamation mark the cell you are picking the information from 
okay so that's all for today i hope this video is helpful thank you see you in the next video peace